Hi, uh, I'm back in uh, Windsor, Ontario, which I guess I consider one of my hometowns. Uh, it was kind of brought home to me last night. Uh, we were out pubbing, and there are people who consider this their hometown, but it is. <laughs> they were born here, they still live here. Uh, I was born in Pennsylvania, raised here in Canada, which I really appreciate when I look at my life and what my parents did for me. But that's one of the things I want to kind of talk about is is creating value. Uh, I look at my life and I think everything I've done, I have created value in it. And that is a conscious choice. Uh, by that I mean, I, uh, if you look at the number of systems that I've decided to study over the years, I've looked at uh, Ekankar, Scientology, uh, emotional healing workshops, uh, transcendental meditation, all different things, just in this kind of a curiosity quest, I guess. And um, I'm going to take uh, just a second, and I'm going to turn my computer. I hope I don't make you seasick, but I just want you to kind of look. I don't, right, this is, this is what I'm looking at. This is, we're looking over it. That's the Detroit skyline, Detroit, Michigan. Uh, that's the Detroit River. That's all that separates this part of Canada from that part of the United States. So it was neat to grow up here. Uh, when we moved here, the Detroit riots were going on so we could see people on top of the uh, buildings shooting at other people and uh, smoke bombs going off, well, real bombs, but they were smoking. But uh, if you look back in your life and there's a place where you haven't created value, that's your choice. Uh, creating value is an absolute choice. It's uh, If you look at your life and say, oh, this person cheated me, I would suggest that you look and see if you can find a way to see how that created value for you. Uh, when Nicole and I married, I mean, we were getting to know each other, which we still are. We've been married 23 or 24 years. I don't keep that track. I know that Mia's 22, so we mean, what, 20, she must be 23, dude. So we've been married that long, and uh, my mentor in the system that I now use, at one point, he and his partner demanded $165,000 as a loan. Well, they forgot to pay the loan back, and we've had to kind of deal with that, my wife and I. And at one point, I sat down and I said, have we created this much value? Because it was mainly out of her inheritance where the money came from. And I said, can we say that we've created $165,000 worth of value in the education that we've gotten and drop this and move on with our lives? She said, yeah, yeah, we can do that. We can, we can call this value and move on. And value created is how you call it. Uh, like I said, I've done a bunch of different systems. Uh, Scientology, I look and see... There were things in it that I really disagreed with, things that I thought were fascinating. So I go with the things that are fascinating. Uh, look at your life. Go back. Uh, if you have a hiccup, see how it taught you something or how you benefited from it and create value and move on. Uh, have a fun day. I'm at the end of this video. It's hard for me to see the numbers on this, but uh, have a fun day. www.micpeakperformance.com. Coming back at you in just a minute.